Hello there, it's anyone here in today's video. Um, let's play today. Um, I'm gonna do an anime topic of something today. And this anime is, um, have you ever always, have you ever always wanted, wanted to make, like, your own manga? Or, like, your own anime? Of, like, a story or, you know, some, something, uh, Something along with those, um, I have a couple of anime stories, I, I, like, I don't have, like, any picture drawings or anything, but I have, like, a, like, a story concept for both of, for and everything, so I might read you guys a couple of story concepts of some anime manga and stuff, so, so I'll share with you guys with those, and talk a little about details with some of those, and see what you guys kind of think how how those would be for like the anime and stuff. So this first one I'm gonna read you guys is called the name of the title of this uh, this anime um, is called Pedal to the Metal. Now um, here it goes. A car driver by the name of Dre Dre Muscle. Now, I might change the name Dre Muscle. I'm not 100 sure if I want to stick with that name. I'm, um, I'm probably going to change that. It is not only a car driver, a car driver, but a driver with who can drive anything with driving instincts at 92 percent, which means, which means he has a. A driving, he has a driving, he has a driving capability where he can just like pretty much drive anything that he could put his foot to the metal to. Um, almost kind of like a baby driver, for example. Um, kind of how that's kind of the story, that's kind of the concept of that. Um, and a car that can change into ten different types of cars. So, this car, part of this kind of came from uh, an idea from a TV show that started, I think it was in the 80s that it started in. And they also did like a 2008 like, reboot adaptation for it, um, which was called Knight Rider, which there was a car that... There was a car named Kit that not only talked, but it did kind of change into other ve other cars too. But the only difference with this one, this one doesn't really talk, but it does have the option to um, it does have the option to like change a car, change other cars. So it's like, so it's like. He has like these ten different types of like muscle cars because this guy, because his character in this story is all about muscle cars. That's like his not only his profession but his like go-to type vehicles. And I, I did also mention he can drive anything, but muscle is like his specialty. Like if if anything, he can actually drive. He can pretty much probably beat just about anything with a, just a muscle car. But he also has capabilities of like understanding how the engine, how the engine work, how all the engines work, all these extra like extra things that work in a car, in a car, what NOS can do, and all this other different type of stuff with a car. Um, so yeah, so we got ten different, so a change from ten different types of cars. It it it. it And how it changes from ten different cars is because the car. So the base car of his is like a Mustang. It's like a Shelby, Shelby Mustang with like red and black racing stripe. Like car is actually like his base car, but like it could change into like Camaro. 
uh, Camaro, Dodge Charger, Challenger, Corvette. Um, it can even transform into other like muscle muscle type vehicles as well. But but I but the th how it works is though because it only has ten different cars. That's actually kind of how the chip reader the chip works. And that's kind of what it is that there's a ch there's like a little microchip that is playing in this car that kind of changes it. So in the car. The chip, I, um, I have the chip called a car changer, is the name of the, the chip I, I call it. But the thing about the chip that you need to understand is like the antagonists in the story actually want that chip because it could change into different things. So I'll get to, I'll get to about who the antagonists are on that here in just a second. Um, call from a chip called car changer. With this story, it has a fast, nefarious, and need for speed uh, tone. So yeah, you got some need for fast, nefarious, need for speed kind of like take for this. And the driver of the story fights against an eagle, Ill, illegal, illegalized fights for fights against legalized illegalized crime for a or, for an organization called the Runners. And a mentor, and a mentor named Indy, but this, but the chip called Car Changer, the evil organization called, called Spark, who won't stop at nothing to get their hands on the chip blueprints to make, to make for themselves, who want to make uh, weapons and other, and, uh, and other things for uh, with this chip. This this story is a is a sit on the edge of your seat and fasten your seat belts for a wild ride. Um, there's a lot there's a lot here I want to do with this story because I'm because it's actually kind of like a racing anime like story. Um, with like Fast and Furious type racing and then other things in there. Um, and what's really interesting with this story is like. Most animes are like, most anime like adaptations are like, are like, like city location wise and anime shows are normally all in Japan. Like, for most part and stuff. Like, I guess for Full Metal Alchemist, they, they had like a, a European kind of like, you know, looks, but still. Um,. But with this, he goes from places, the, the main character, he goes from places like Hong Kong, China, uh, Beijing, China, because there are a couple places in China, you know, Tokyo, Japan, um, Bangkok, Thailand, also um, South Korea, Seoul, Los Angeles, California, New York. Uh, so some of these, like, you know, places like that. So it kind of goes from those places, um, Las Vegas. Zada is another one as well. So he kind of goes from he kind of goes to those places and basically fights against a crime because of um, the evil organization called Spark. Some of those some of the organizations are scattered out around those types of uh, around those places and stuff. So and his main goal is to like not only shut them down but to like so um. But yeah, there's a lot to this story that I'm trying to finish, that I'm trying to do with this, so, um, it's pretty much the concept that I have so far. Now, as far as, like, um, other, like, more and story-wise, like, I, I have a good arc. There's a, there's a, there, 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 I have a couple arcs, I have, like, a, I have, like, a pretty interesting long arc that he does, that, that, that he's in the middle of. There's also like a small mini arc and stuff with it too, um, where one of them, where the the main protagonist of the show, he gets he gets framed and thrown into thrown into jail. But in this jail, he gets framed for a murder. He gets framed for something he didn't do, and so he ends up getting thrown in jail and stuff like that. Um, 
and one of the things in the story is it kind of has like a it's the concept kind of feels like a death race concept but I have it more I have it pointed more towards Mario Kart kind of like feel with it than death race um one of the things that goes on is he gets put on a chain game and they go out to like this junkyard where all these cars are all beaten the crap out of and they have to choose a car for this race and whoever wins the race whoever wins whoever wins a race gets to get out of jail for free with a sign on paper and then those who don't win, yeah, I get, they just stay there. <laughs> but um, that's kind of the main plot point of this, of that. But there's a lot, to, there's a lot to do with that story as well. Um, that's about it. And this story is called Pedal of the Metal. And the reason why it's called Pedal of the Metal is because for this show, you do have like rock metal, like like rock metal, like. Uh, uh, song, uh, songs and sounds and stuff going on in the background and stuff, and so it's, it's which, which is why I have it called Pedal and Metal. So there's a lot there. Um, I've always wanted to have, I always wanted to have, you know, I've always wanted to do like my own like story adaptations. Now I can't really draw characters, which I'd like to learn how to do. But I can kind of draw, um, I can kind of make, you know, story at stories and stuff, and maybe a script. I haven't figured out script-wise yet, but that's about all I can do with as far as, like, anime and manga story right now. Okay, moving on to another story. I have two I'm going to read you guys here. So, this next one I have here is called... Sports Masters is the name of this. So this is a sports anime. Um, this is actually kind of an interesting kind of like sports anime. So the story, the, here is the story. Once every three years, a sports competition takes place of 15 different sports going on with a thousand player, with a thousand players participating must choose 15 player groups. But the sports in this competition are football, baseball, basketball, hockey, soccer, track and field, tennis, volleyball, badminton, ping pong, lacrosse, swimming, bicycling, uh, boxing or kickbox, and boxing or kickboxing, bowling, and and bowl, um, which are group which. Whichever group comes on, on, on top will be declared Sportsmasters Champions. The groups enter act like eSport, eSports, or ML, MLG, which, whichever you want to call it. There are many, there are many likable characters. The one protagonist has played, one protagonist of the show, Or one of the protagonists of the show, the main character of the show, has played every sports, every sport out there. But there are many others, there are many others as well that have done the same thing as he has. Lots of good, good battles and good characters arcs, battle uh, arcs. But it's a story that it, that it's a story that's to put you in for a wild ride experience. So, every three years, there's a sports competition that takes place where all these sports bundle up into like a in this competition. Now, it's kind of treated as almost like an Olympic event, where you know how like Olympic thing is this track and field, where just different track and field events. Well, with this one, it's with sport events. So you got football, baseball, basketball. All those types of sport, all the different sports going on at the same, going on in this like Olympic like event, and whoever, wh whichever group finish, finishes out winning out of these 
different types of sports going on will be declared, you know, the sports champion masters. And there's a lot to do with this story, too, but, um, it's kind of an interesting kind of, like, concept, because she you imagine playing 15 different types of sports in one, 15 different types of sports in this, in this, like, interesting, like, Olympic event, where as soon as you're done with football, as soon as you're done with football out of, out of, out of, the, whole, out of the deal, everyone has, has had their football time. Then, it's, then they go play a baseball one right after, and then they do that. So it's basically, but one of the characters of the, sh of the show has played all those types of sports. There's a few of them, there's some that have not, so even though they're trying out those other sports, it's an interesting thing with them because they've never done those, so, and because there's 15 player, 15 player groups, so they've got 15 characters that have their own teams that are, that are participating in this competition, they all have to kind of like not only work together and do teamwork, because that, that, there is that in their story, um, but they all have to like learn how to interact and, and stuff, but you have that, but you also have other, other main characters of the shows that have played, other that have played most, most majority of the sports, like, the one main character has. Now, as far as, like, character-wise, I haven't really picked a name out for the main character, so, um, that's kind of the whole concept of, uh, the story is, you know, for, like, a sports anime. And that's pretty much what I have here, um... I'd share those with you guys. I uh, always wonder what what you guys would think of uh, <clears throat> what it'd be like to write your own like sports animes and stuff. So, or not just sports anime, but any any anime in general, really. Um, post a comment section below and tell me like what anime what anime stories you have that you thought of that what you thought of that you'd like to try to write out, and I'd love to hear what you guys have put on there. Um, Post a comment section below, and if you like this video, like button, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit share button as always, and I'll see you in the next video, and goodbye.